A massive sandbar has formed on a Jersey Shore inlet, and officials there say that they're concerned about the impact that it could have on boaters. Nick Calloway covers New Jersey and has more now from Manasquan. Joe Pereira has been fishing the Manasquan Inlet almost 15 years. Here goes one. Some days there are big fish. Today, not so much. But across the water, a real whopper. A large shoal or sandbar has formed on the Point Pleasant Beach side of the inlet, bigger than Pereira has ever seen. Never, never. Not even up to Sandy was it like that. There is concern that boats going through could run aground or be capsized by the large waves created by the sandbar. Local officials have asked the Corps of Engineers to come and dredge the area as soon as possible. This inlet is one of the most used inlets on the East Coast, and so keeping it open for economic viability and for tourism viability is a top priority. As we were interviewing Manasquan Mayor Michael Mangan, a sign of progress. We see a boat here from the Army Corps of Engineers. We were told that they'd be surveying this week. So. A spokesperson for the Army Corps of Engineers confirmed the vessel was doing some surveying and a quick round of dredging Tuesday. It'll have to come back to finish the job, but leaving with some hope in its wake. Officials with the Corps of Engineers tell me they expect the full dredging process to be completed in a few weeks' time. In Manasquan, down the Jersey Shore, Nick Calloway, CBS News, New York.